Now with a heartwarming holiday tale, adding a dimension of inclusion and connection for many families. Author Nancy Red's story of the real Santa. I want my children to grow up in a society where they don't have to color themselves in to see themselves in print. The Real Santa follows a little boy based on my own son and the millions of kids who look like him, who's yearning to know what the world's most elusive icon actually looks like. As a child, I always wondered what the Real Santa looked like. Did he look like the white Santas at the mall or the black Santas in my home? Growing up in the 1980s and 1990s, before diversity and merchandising was a thing, there wasn't a holiday where we didn't have brown markers and crayons and colored pencils all over our kitchen table. We would get the brown marker treatment to look more like our own family because we couldn't buy things in the stores that represented us. Nothing much had really changed in the two decades between when I was a 10 year old and when I had my child. Now more than ever, it's very important that people grow up from the time they're very little understanding that their perspective is not the only one. When you're writing, a lot of pain, a lot of issues get stirred up. But the beautiful thing about children's books, is children know nothing except joy. So what I love about The Real Santa is it's not about the lack of representation elsewhere. It's about this child's home, the safety and security within it. My favorite line in The Real Santa comes after the little boy has been looking at all his different Santas and he's just gotten a really great Santa. And he actually says, I love all of my Santas, but on Christmas Eve, only one matters, the real Santa. Which one could he be? I love that line because that is a great way to contextualize the way we acknowledge Santa looks different in different ways. People's reactions to the real Santa have been so incredible and heartwarming. I love people reaching out to me, telling me how much the real Santa means to them and to their family. My hope for the real Santa is that everyone who celebrates Christmas and loves Santa reads it, enjoys it, and sees a perspective that's meaningful to them. Our society has many different people with many different traditions, and we all deserve to see ourselves in print. Merry Christmas! <laughs> oh, that's cute. And you can find the real Santa wherever books are sold. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.